Hey everybody, this is me, MC Gamer, and you are now tuned into a Let's Play Wind Waker. On the last episode of Wind Waker, we had finished up our item collection, getting ready for these dungeons that we're about to start right now. So we are here at Headstone Isle. Here it is, or island, right here on the map. And we are going to approach this here big old thing. And uh, usually this would be a much of a problem, but I am Link here, may roar. Roar. Okay, so we just picked this thing up. Toss it to the side, because we're like Chuck Norris and crap. So let's go on in. Let's see what we have. Ooh. Ah. It's a rock. That's pretty easy. I can do that. Look at this. Like, where's my hand? Oh, where's my finger? Oh, oh, you can see it. Oh, oh. Okay, sorry. Here we go. Yeah, you learned the Earth God's lyric. Oh, great hero, chosen by the Master Sword. My name is Laruta. I am a Zora Sage. For an age, I offered my prayers here in the Earth Temple, praying that the power to repel evil would ever remain with the Master Sword. And yet, unfortunately, due to Ganondorf's evil designs, the Master Sword you hold has lost this power. After his defeat at the hands of the Hero of Time, Gandalf was sealed away, but not for all time. He was revived, and he returned to Hyrule with a red wrath. He attacked this temple and stole my soul, knowing that he had to remove the power contained inside that chain to the blade. In order to return the power to repel evil to your sword, you must find another to take my steed inside this temple and ask the gods for their assistance. You must find the one who carries on my bloodline, the one who holds this sacred instrument. Nothing can stop the flow of time or the passing of generations, but the fate carried within my bloodline endures the ravages of all the years. It survives. The song you just conducted is one which will open the eyes of the new sage and awaken within that sage the melody that will carry our prayers to the gods. The door that blocks your way will only open when the sage plays that song. May the winds of fortune blow with you. Well, you know what that means. We're going to Dragon Roost Island with the place with the awesome music and the bird lady that has the instrument that Tackle had. Woohoo! Dragon Roost with the awesome music. And like magic, here we are at the place with the awesome music. Oh man. But now with a harp, faintly in distance, as adding to the plot line. Don't you all love plot lines? I love plot lines. Me and plot lines go way back. Me and plot lines went to college together, in fact. That's right. I went with... <laughs> I'm just going to stop the joke. It's not funny. So we're just, just going to stop and hope for the best. Ooh, is it sidle time? It is sidle time, everyone. Sidle, 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 sidle. Guess what's next? Sidle. That's right. Sidle, sidle, sidle. All right, so let's uh, have a drop. There we go. Sweetness. Okay, so let's go check on the bird people. Hopefully they don't regret their decision to give me that magic bag with the power to repel evil. Or hold letters. Okay, so... 
We have to go out one of these doors, and I always forget which one, so... Uh, I choose you! Pikachu? What do we got? What do we got? Ah, that's the right one. Okay, so we're gonna pull out our grappling hook and give it a toss up through to that that bar. I was gonna call it something completely different, but that would make no sense. Hey, are we ready for an awesome cutscene? I am ready for an awesome cutscene. My body is ready. Okay, here we go. Greetings. Oh, Link. I forgot my voice for. Oh, Link, you're okay. You know, Prince Kamali has been asking me all about your adventures, Link. I turned British while you were gone. I don't remember if I was British or not when you were here. I can rest easy now that I've seen you safe and sound with my own eyes. Prince Kamali turned out a fine young adult, hasn't he? Recently, he's even begun doing things on his own without my guidance. Every conversation still ends up centered on you, though, Link. Watching Prince Kamali grow up fills me with pride, but it makes me a little sad as well. I wonder if this is how a mother feels. Oh, but just listen to me go on. How weird I must sound. <laughs> well, I better be cracked, blah, blah. Because playing harp is important to the culture of the bird people. I got a thing. 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 Hey, is that the Wind Waker? How cool. Link, will you come talk to me? I wonder how I'll do. Song. It sounds so familiar. Some of the song I forgot is trying to be. Remember. Bird. Get it. Remember. I'm a bird lady. Falling over now. Catch me. It's a Triforce in the ground with a master sword floating above it with the gaze and the closing of the eyes and stuff. Oh boy. <laughs> She's dead. <laughs> Just now I'll say it spoke to me. She spoke ever so gently. She said, act more British, you little... Grumpet to something, something I must do. Link, thanks to you, I've been awakened to the knowledge that I'm a sage of the Earth Temple. It's actually something I could do to help this world. It's incredible. What the crap was that? I bet my teacher knew all about this. Did you see that tear? That was an awesome tear, Nintendo. Link, please, you must take me to the Earth Temple. We must hurry and wake the powder of power evil that sleeps within the Master Sword. Let's go now, quickly and quietly. Kamali has wanted to remember me as a simple attendant.
breaks the dramatic moment with a humorous sentence. <laughs> hey, we got a woman on the boat. King of Alliance, I got a woman on the boat. Woman on the boat. Woman on the boat going to Headstone Island. All right, here we are back at Headstone Island. Now with cutscene vision. Medley, listen carefully to what I'm about to tell you. It's been a while since I spoke, I realize. The Temple of Hedges is the nest of an evil creature. The same creature that stole the life of your predecessor, the Sage. It's a dark and frightening place. That is why, if you do nothing else, I'll then at least do this. If Link comes near you and presses R to call you by saying, Come on! Hold on, let me try that. Come on! I, I can't do Then be silent and follow closely behind him. And if Link presses A, I don't really know what an A button is either. Allow him to lift you and blah and fly crap. I don't really care. Yo, boy. Yo, if she gets stuck like an idiot, you know you can use that wind waker thing to take over her mind and bend her will to your liking. Yeah, I got it. Link, protect Medley and Medley protect Link. The power of Pell Evil shall surely be returned to the Magic Sword. <laughs> All right, let's go on in. <laughs> okay, you stay here. Let's go. This melody is so enticing, I love it. The rock is overpowered by the power of music and promptly blows up into nothing. That there's no there's no trace of it even anymore. Okay, let's walk in dramatically because that's what we do. Yep. Yep. And everyone, I'd like to welcome you to The Earth Temple. This is the next dungeon in the game that we get to have medley with. Come on! Come on! I mean, it's going to be great, and it's going to be a lot of fun. But unfortunately, we're not going to be starting it this time on Wind Waker. So tune in next time. Uh, thank you all for watching. See you later. Hey, everybody. I'm Red Eject, and I'm a fan of MC Gamer. Any awesome people out there, why don't you go and hit that little yellow button?